Jim. ¿Quiere hablar un poco más alto, por favor? ¿Qué es He wants for you to talk louder. ¿Does he speak English? No. Well, somebody's going to get hurt. They're not afraid of getting hurt. They're afraid of leaving their home. They're afraid of leaving their friends, of losing their community, of losing the alma, el espíritu, la uni. ¿Qué es la palabra que busco, Rodríguez? Acercamiento. Es acercamiento. El acercamiento. And you don't understand that. That's true. I I don't understand that. But I do know what you're talking about. And you know I know what you're talking about, or you wouldn't be talking to me now. Can you tell them uh, where they're going to live? Can you tell them where they're going to uh, work? You know, personally, I can make a living anywhere. Miss <laughs> Elizondo, the fact of the matter is that this property does not belong to them. Now, you went to court, you tried to get the eviction changed, and you couldn't do it. You tried to get an extension on the eviction, you couldn't do that either. We do not leave until we have a place to go. Everybody, all together. There are 60 policemen out there with weapons who are not going to go away. Es importante que usted, uh, ustedes uh, comprenden la uh, el, uh, ¿Qué pasa aquí? Cookie? <laughs> no, thank you. Uh, gracias, no. <laughs> please, Miss Elizondo. Please. Tell them that I will do everything in my power to see to it that each and every one of them is properly relocated. Sure. You don't think they've been told that before? Please tell them I respect their position. I know that they are determined. I know they have courage. I know they have weapons. But they can't win. All right, look, you have, you have friends in here. Well, I have friends out there. Now, Mr. Alexander, somebody is going to get killed because this place is going to be cleared out one way or another. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't have enough friends that I can afford to lose even one. Okay? It's a very good question, Mr. Rodriguez. <laughs> very good question. 